Parental discretion is advised. This show is brought to you by IndieWrestling.us. Check out IWC, RWA, and more. And listeners like you, support this show at Patreon.com slash Wrestling Mayhem Show. Just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait, just wait. It is the Raw Wrap-Up on Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter. We're completely not doing this uh, over again, uh, but it is the show where we uh, talk about Monday Night Raw and we're taking a special Two Truths and a Lie, which will probably be the case because of the worst schedule of one mad Mike joining us from Poughkeepsie, New York. Oh, man, I haven't seen anything on Raw, and I definitely haven't said this before, but thank you, Alex Miller, for telling us it's going to be a season four of Lucha Underground. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Uh, so we're going to have some fun here. Like I said, the, uh, when Mike, Mike, uh, you know, it's a holiday season. The work schedule is not great for him. He doesn't get to watch Monday Night Raw live with, with, the, with the most of the rest of us or anything like that. So we have a lot of fun by uh, doing two truths and a lie. Yeah, and, and I usually watch Raw after – after we finish this show, and then I live tweet on at Mayhem Show. So yeah, absolutely. look for the hashtag at Mayhem. Absolutely. So uh, we're going to do that two truths and a lie here tonight, completely for the first time. I, and, well, to be fair, I still don't know what the answer is. You don't know what the answer is. So the two truths, the, the, the three truths are, ready, man, Mike? You're yes. hearing these completely for the first time again. Absolutely for the first time again. Yes. The Shield wrestled a match for the first time since reuniting. Okay. Stephanie McMahon replaced all five members of Team Raw. <laughs> it still makes me giggle. <laughs> and Bray Wyatt got a thank you Wyatt chant for injuring Jason Jordan. <laughs> God. I, uh, I don't know if I've changed my mind. Okay. Um, and what was okay, your thinking? I, what was your thinking? Okay, well, I, I'm 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 gonna break this down. So basically, you're telling me that either Raw gave away the Shield reuniting as six man for free, unadvertised and unpromoted, um, or they changed half of their entire main event uh, six days before the pay per view, or that Bray Wyatt should just be a face and actually just gets cheered for things. Um, I want to believe the Bray Wyatt thing is true. And if I know the idiots behind Raw, I fucking know that they put the shield in a six-man tag. And I'll even tell you who I think the opponents were. Oh, okay. Bonus points for yeah, this. Bonus, bonus mayhem points. points. So I'm saying Stephanie replacing the whole male side of the team is false. I don't wow. believe that's true. Because really? Because I think you, I, you're not replacing Braun Strowman. Okay. That's my entire basis of the argument. You can take out Finn. You can take out Joe. You can take out Angle. You can take out Jordan. You're not replacing Braun Strowman. Braun Strowman's going to be on that team. Okay. Um, but who I think the Shield wrestled, the Miz Close. Ha! Okay. You right, are so correct in the in the uh, Stephanie McMahon replacing all five members of Team Raw being absolutely false, and that was actually submitted by our boy Brandon Ooh, as part you. of his submissions tonight. So I did use his false for tonight. There that was you a go. Good choice. And uh, the Shield actually took on the Miz. And the bar. Ah! So the, so Miz 2.0. Yes. Yeah. So so I'll give you a half point on that one. All right. So uh, I, I believe as Brandon Stroud, Brandon Stroud calls him the bar Mizfa. <laughs> <laughs> yes, probably. Yes, probably. Yeah. Uh, so okay. with that. So I, I, was, I was really close. I was really close. No, you that. you were really close on that. That was, that was good. So Jason Jordan is officially injured. Uh, well, Bray Wyatt did injure him. Yes. Yes. Okay. Absolutely. So that, that means he's. Definitely turning on Team Raw. Oh, he has to, right? He has definitely. To. So, did Stephanie replace him? Hold on, hold on. We'll, oh, we'll oh, find oh, out. Okay. We'll find okay. out. Okay. Yay. Okay. Okay. Oh, no. So, oh, this no. one. It's going to be Kane, isn't it? So, for for this one. Sad panda. Kane acknowledged his mayoral campaign on the air. <laughs> Truth okay. number two. Okay. Someone proposed during WWE Raw. And the crowd chanted, she said yes, interrupting the Paul Heyman promo. Ooh. Okay. That's that that's different. And finally, okay. Triple H is the fifth member of Team Raw. Oh, fuck my ass. <laughs> um I love your reactions. Oh 
God. As if any of these could be real. God, I know two of them are. That's frightening to me. Um, all right. Well, Kane acknowledging his mayoral run. I think I buy that. I think, oh, oh, maybe. All right. I'm not, I'm not, I'm undecided. I'm undecided on that one. Triple H is the fifth raw member. Of fucking course he is because he's triple goddamn H. Um, and and they just announced John Cena on SmackDown, so sure, let let's pre-plan that WrestleMania match. Um, yeah, so Triple H, I'm gonna say, is absolutely 100% true because, of course, it is. Definitely couldn't have put like Matt Hardy or someone in like that, or or even fucking Kane. Uh. What what was the second one that the that someone proposed during the Heyman speech? Yes, and the crowd. I'm gonna say that's bullshit because no one would interrupt Paul Heyman talking. Plus, when I think romantic, I do not think Brock Lesnar. I don't think that. Maybe it's just me. Maybe I'm a purist. I don't know. So I'm gonna say that's bullshit, Sorg. You are wrong. Damn it! Okay. There was a he, he was going to the promo. He was illustrating his five points of why you're going to buy a subscribe to the network to watch Survivor Series. And uh-huh. I think partway into point one or two, there was a she said yes chant going on. And he stopped, acknowledged and yelled at the people for interrupting his promo. <laughs> like, I think directly at supposedly the person that got proposed to. <laughs> Paul Heyman's amazing. Uh- <laughs> It's just in. Paul Heyman hates love. Um, well, why do you propose during Heyman's promo? Oh, what a weird time! Like there are, there were probably at least three matches that went to commercial breaks. Sorg, at least three matches that went to commercial breaks. Yes, that's when you propose, motherfucker. If you're gonna propose at a wrestling show, which is idiotic, by the way. Yes, even you, John Cena. Even you. Uh, it's like, you know, it makes sense because it's like, hey, you know what? I'm going to pop the question when the jar when the shark pops out of the water. Hey, hey, no. At, jo- at the Jaws ride. Sork? So Sork? When, when Brock jumps on the ring, that's when you're going to do it. That's the shark Jaws Sork. equivalent. Sorg. That shark popping out of the water is the most romantic thing. Mm-hmm. And we both know that's a fucking mall rats reference. All right. You can't slip a mall rats reference past me in this. All right, so one of those things still has to be bullshit. Um, I'm guessing maybe Kane didn't reference his mayoral candidacy. Correct. That is false, sir. Triple H is completely the fifth member Uh, of Team Raw. Why? I've never said this before. Why couldn't it have been Kane? Daddy's home. Oh, Oh, did he say that? No. Jesus. But he's definitely in daddy daddy trips mode. Oh. I, 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 uh, so Jason Jordan is definitely screwing over Team Raw. Oh, God. Oh, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. I, you know, I don't care about this 5 on 5 anymore. I don't care about the 5 on 5 anymore. I don't. Beyond that, beyond that, though, there's three people over 45 in it, Sorg. There are there's uh, three people. Three. There might be four at this point. Who else? Oh, not no. Nakamura's not over forty. Oh no 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 no. Oh, Neither anyways, anyways. Neither so there's a lot of yeah. there's a lot of the uh, forty club in there. Uh, at least, yeah, so. at the at the forty forty club ESPN on the screen. I got something like that. All right. Yeah. So for the final trilogy I have here set up, um, we're gonna wait for you to finish drinking. Oscar, okay. Uh, it, it, in a great throwback to NXT, Oscar kicked Dana Brooks' head off. Okay. 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 All right. Yeah. Yeah. On two hundred five live, we're going to celebrate Kalisto's birthday. Oh God, that sounds terrible. Okay. The ring collapsed from a Kane versus Braun suplex in the main event. Oh, that's bullshit. That's bullshit. That's that's bullshit. You don't do a ring collapse unless the big show's involved. Mm. Sorry, you don't do it. You don't do it. Mm. Cause Braun is strong. He ain't that big. I want to say you are correct. Because yes. what really did happen is there was a choke slam through the ring. 
Yeah, no, that's that's completely understandable. Okay. That's completely understandable. Which also, means yes. bullshit. Kane chokeslam Braun through the stage? No, through the ring. Through the ring? Yeah. Fuck you. <laughs> Why? Why are people over forty getting pushed? Wait, 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 wait. Actually, I can't remember. I honestly, in the world, fuck people over forty. You, you know what's weird? I don't know. I who, don't want to see no, white no, no, men no. over forty doing good I, things. I don't. I don't. I actually don't remember who delivered the. No, it's actually Braun drove Kane through the ring. Okay, that's much better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry. That's much better. Okay. Yeah, All I actually right, didn't. Much... I actually didn't see the act. I looked up and I'm like, oh shit, they went through the ring. Okay, all right, that's much so, better. That's, that's on me, that's on me. Okay, all right, that is much better. Which means tomorrow we are going to celebrate Kalisto's birthday on 205 Live, oh, being advertised, God. and Asuka did kick Data Brooks' head off because uh, when or they were Dana. doing the three-way, uh, Asuka, Asuka was like, they had like the rest of the team that was already announced out there, like mm -hmm. watching the match to see who was going to be the final. Uh, Dana was, was on the outside. Asuka was helping her up. She pushed Asuka. Asuka chased her through the ring and kicked her head off on the other side. Well, I mean, that... Nobody's ready for Asuka. Asuka was being nice. Hey, uh, that's Asuka not in her so character. Nice. I, I don't blame Dana for pushing her away. I wouldn't trust that. Oh, I'm sorry. It was a body slam. It was a body slam that Braun delivered. Okay. Or, like, the power slam or whatever. Mm -hmm. Okay. Still. Um... Oh, oh man, 205 Live. That is that if you want a way to draw me in 205 Live, that is not a way to do it. Nope. Um so Sorg, did did we get any kind of announcements for more Survivor Series matches? We no, no, no but we have plenty. Do we? Uh if you look at I don't think we do. No, 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 no. I was looking at the list. We have plenty. We have, hold on a second. Oh, we do officially have the Shield versus New Day. Oh, okay, that's official. That did yeah. happen. Okay. That did okay, happen. Good. Okay. So, good. I, unfortunately, I don't get a chance to listen to the the first intro or the first promo, so I I don't get a lot of context there. Uh, okay. But uh, yeah, there's that. Um, I'm trying to pull up. Uh, other than that, I mean, we have we do know the cruiserweight title is on the pre-show. Uh, there is the. Of course it is. <laughs> there's two Survivor of Series course. matches. There is about one, two, three title versus title matches between women's tag team and the uh, the the main titles. And so, the mid carters. And yeah. And the mid carters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That that too. Um, okay, so so we didn't get a cruiserweights versus European five ten man tag. I don't announced. think Nothing. so. Oh, oh, that's super disappointing. It is a little bit disappointing. That is no, that, that's not a little disappointing. That is super disappointing. That is super duper disappointing. Oh man, okay. Maybe that'll be announced on two hundred five live. It could be. It could be as a as maybe. A I, I don't, um, scanning I don't real quick. Hopes. No, it's not. It's not announced officially. Okay. So. Um, That's unfortunate. But either way, I thought it was a very energetic raw for tonight. Um, so, so Sorg, uh, so Bailey's the fifth member of the women's team. Yes, and not um, everyone's pasty face porn star. Not her. There was no page tonight. Of course, there wasn't, because the internet is always wrong, fuckers. Just I because guarantee. just because you want it to happen doesn't make it make it news. I don't even want it to happen. I, I can honestly. Care. I couldn't. No, I, I I want her to be okay. I don't think her being on TV helps that. Right no, now. no, 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 no. If anything, I'd rather see her in NXT. Keep um, her in and and the heads yeah. up, it is a four-hour show for a Survivor Series. Of course, it is with a two-hour pre-show. Oh, probably, probably. Like, so I, there, there's hope for another ten man yet. Yes, yes. So we are going to be hanging out here um, for anybody in the area who wants to come out and hang out and watch Survivor Series with us. I may be a little late because I actually have a gig that day, uh, and I know it ends at 5, so I probably won't see much of the pre-show. Depends on how our, our breakdown goes, but uh, it's going to be it's gonna be interesting. Of course, uh, we'll talk more Wrestling Mayhem show. I would give tonight's uh, Raw a solid two and a half hours watchable. 
Oh God, that does, it does. Sword, you have not explained one match to me tonight, except except for Shield versus Miz in the bar. And if yeah, that's one of the matches, was I really don't care. I thought it was good, watchable, and you know, on the side of everything else going on. Uh, a, a great promo. Look out for the promo from the Miz uh, during this uh, obviously, TV. Yeah. Obviously, obviously, as always. Yeah. You know, he reminds you why why the Miz is awesome. Um, he reminds me why every week why the Miz should be Universal Champion. Absolutely. God, could you imagine Miz versus AJ Styles? I'm sorry, I know AJ versus Brock is going to be great, but Miz versus AJ would be fucking awesome. And then not only that, we do have War Games, which I'm not even going to be able to watch. I will not. I have no time to watch it until after Survivor Series. I think I'm actually off Saturday night, so I what? might. Get, I might get to watch War Games. Would live. be bad if I just made made two other people work a wrestling show so I can watch War Games live. I think you should do that, but I think you should do that without saying you're going to do that live on this program. Oh well, that's okay. None of them watch us. Okay, then that's fine then. <laughs> Mad Mike, where can people find you? You can find me at a toy store. No, you can find me. <laughs> At Mad Mike four eight eight three on the inter- on the internet's on the Twitter machines. Also, go to Ad Mayhem Show. Look for the hashtag MM for when I do live tweet raw uh, later tonight. Absolutely, I'm at Sorgatron on the Twitter. Sorgatronmedia.com for all the fine pack- podcasts that we have going on. Our good friend uh, uh, DJ Lunchbox is back with Panel Riot with a new cast. So please go check that out at, uh, at Sorgatronmedia.com, PanelRiot.com on the Sorgatron Media Podcast Network. And we also have uh, this week on Wrestling Mayhem Show at 10 p.m. Eastern Time on Tuesday. We'll be live in studio with manager BC Steele joining us. Always a good time. He's already uh, told us that he wants to talk about porn stars for some reason. So we'll find out what that's about and have a blast with that as well. Thank you, Mad Mike. And until next time, uh, hey, uh, thanks everybody on the chat room as well. Uh, rocking it all night. Uh, thanks, Tom, Tina, Dave, Alex, and Brandon, and Matt uh, hanging out uh, all night with us. Uh, we'll see you guys next time. And until then, keep it raw.